All right, guys, we are back. I'm your host, Doug Polk. And for everyone that stuck through us through that break, I want to give a personal thank you. Because it's people like you, the good heroes, that stand with Poker Night through the thick and the thin. Through whatever lineup of, of commenter, commenters they have to see. It's you good people that make this show. I didn't realize we were going that know. long. I apologize. That Phil is still f finishing a sandwich. I know you're a little bit stressed out. So. The stream. Matt, Matt, yeah. Glenn does look stressed out. Phil, I'm with you. I don't blame you. Thanks. No problem, guys. All Thank right. you. Much love. All right, let's get to that third match, Phil. No, thank you. Yeah, it's on. Yep. All right, and we're back on the felt. Couple hands out of the gate. Some really premium ones. Is that factory? What's up, man? I haven't seen you in a little while. Welcome back. How much will that guy accept for you to punch him in the face? That's a good question. Helmy continuing his winning ways, winning the first pot out of the gate. So your next stop is London, 88 8 tournament? Yep, right after this to London. And then I'll see you in Rosvedov as well. Rosvedov. Caitlin just texted me. I won't know about Shannon, huh? I know about everything. I don't like it when you smile. <laughs> wow. Yeah, there was 5, 10, 20, no limit. 2K man, anyone want to play, please be supervisor. That's what you just put in a stack of purples. <laughs> no, that was never happening. You, you felt really strong to me, but I still didn't want to fold. You know, like, maybe you had ace deuce, and that's why I didn't want to fold. We got three of a kind here on the turn for Tonka, but Phil Helm does have a fuss draw. Might decide to make a move. Where in one? Check, Check called call Brick River. I think this is going to kind of be it. I want to welcome MD everyone to uh, round two of match two today. The winner of this will face <coughs> off against Olivier Bousquet in our grand final tomorrow at 6 o'clock Eastern, 3 o'clock Pacific time. Last call for Steven Ed, 
A little less talking here for our two now full contestants as Helmy decides to bet with the second pair. Tonka with third pair, probably going to consider his options. Man, I should have bet less. Damn it. Did you have hearts too? I did. Oh, I needed hearts. Oh, three hearts match over. Come on, deal me the cooler. Why are you getting all the coolers? Wait, cooler? Wait, you lost 300. You lost an ante on that. I overbet it. Cooler would have been if it came hard, hard, hard. I mean. Yeah, but you're just begging for the coolers, you know? Hmm. I'm, 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 I'm deserving of the coolers. I, it's true. If I notice you had two lower hearts than me, I do say, why didn't it come like you? Yeah. Check, check here on the flop. Helmuth improves to third pair to take the lead on the turn. Picks up that pot. Still even stacks here. Just a few hands into our round two. Chris Rat 23, Doug, are you hosting the next? You hear them talking the back there like well? this is already over. I will be. Uh, I don't think anybody said that. 25th and 26th. I think the conversation is if Phil wins, who would you who would you root for? Pair for Tonka, but a better pair for Helmuth. Got not kicked. Helmuth improves to two pair in the river. You have picked up any brothers, thank you. And I am good, quad aces with Jack. Congratulations, you just won $1,000. $500 I am to qualifying third right now. Two pair. Bet call and Phil showed Tonka I mean, the bad loose call. news. Should have just used the reveal. Fuck, I forgot we had them. But you paid the you price. You had a jack or a seven? I had a seven. Yeah, that reveal button is going to save one of us four or five thousand eventually. I feel like should have just saved me then. <laughs> Confirmed wreck by White Magic. Tonga looks down the King-10 offsuit. I imagine he's coming for a raise, which he does. It's a tenner to go. Helmuth with just the slow play here with the ace-queen. The Check. Big Ten nine deuce. Tonka moves into the lead with top pair second kicker. Helmuth breaks with his ace-queen, but probably not going anywhere here on the flop. Check that call. Dark check for Helmuth. I'm 
much. Helmuth looks to be cutting out some chips for a turn call, but this would be a little bit on the light side. Really thinking this over. Let's it go. Good fold from Helm Youth and Tonka picks one up. I felt like a you ever misfire. That was a misfired. You know what I mean? Like a misfire? A misfire, yeah. Who? Mine. Well, they, they could see what I had. You can't. So to the, to the world, it makes sense that, that was kind of a misfire. You know? So I, I'm, I'm very confused. <laughs> I don't know uh, if I misfired, if you misfired. It wasn't you. You might have made a really good play. <laughs> I, see, I, I just called you with ace-queen last hand. Because I, I noticed you're starting to bet more flop, turn, river. And I can call you down with ace-queen high on a lot of boards, you know? Why do you tell tell people what, 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 what you're doing? They never adjust. They never adjust? It's the adjust? craziest thing I've ever seen. That's what you said Rich Doug, too. Nobody has ever adjusted to you? Come on. Of course, some people. It's very rare. Like... I can tell them what they're doing, and they just keep doing it. <coughs> it's, it really is, it baffles me how, how long that's happened. For the record, I did try to make some adjustments, but uh, check didn't get me very far. Queen 7 for Helmy, 10 7 for Tonka, A6 4, both players brick. So checks it over to Tonka. What will he decide to do? Check, check, and Eight. Bill looks like he's going for it. 800 gets the job done. You know, when it's my blind, my small blind, they should just leave 300 out there. <laughs> Do it. <laughs> it's, I mean, just as often as I don't raise pre-flop, you know. Phil with the pack of nines. Just going to call. Getting his trap on here, so to speak. Three thousand. Getting kind of weird now. Phil goes for the limp re-raise in his pocket lines. Let's see what happens from here. Eight for Trey. No help to Tonka. Both players do have a club. 4,000. I feel like you have ace, queen, high, or sevens. I can't figure Check it out. Check call from Tonka. Trade in the turn. Spot getting a little dicey for Tonka. 6,600. 6,600 from Phil. And now Tonka kind of has to make a pretty big decision. If he does call here, 
he sort of has to intend on calling a lot of rivers. Obviously, he can only improve on a six. So you got to make a decision right here. He does I call. I wonder if I can do And it. unless this river is a six, Phil is going to win a big one. He might have an eight. Here is a jack. Check from Tonka. Phil thinks he's good. 12,200. <sighs> Rough spot for Tonka here on the river. Not a great situation if Phil has, and Tonga does make the call. Good. And already right out of the gate, Phil's got him on the ropes. That was a huge pot. Helmuth now up to 80,000. Tonka on only 21,000 here okay. in the second nice. match. got some work to do. That's definitely true here. Uh, do you have 20? Two, three. I'm not going to raise. I'm just trying to get a count. Eight. 15? 16, 17, something like that. 17, I think. Right. 10, 16, 16 about 20, 17, yeah. 19, uh, over 20, you're right. Yeah, Randy, I don't know how I miscounted that. It's okay. Check. Ten, ten, seven. ace high for Tonka, king high for Helmuth. Jack on the turn, nobody improves. Kim, are you still in the tournament? Check. Check. King. Ace. King not going to get it done. George, Tonka picks up a really George. small one. He's going to need a lot of those if he wants to get back in this. Tonka out of the gate, already down to the 22,000, but he's still in this. He's got a long way to go. He's going to have to come back to win this one and then also win the final match. But you know what's a good starting place, guys? How about a flush for Tonka? We got some Tonka fans in the chat. Let's do it. Where are Tonka fans at? Anyone here like Tonka? Not exactly the size of the pot you want to win, but a win nonetheless. So uh, the 888 main event is $2,000 buying and one entered. 2,000 pounds? Or? It'll be euros. No, it'll be pounds. Pounds now, yeah. yeah. Honestly, I have no idea what it is. It's like, man, I, it's I don't 1,500 know. or 2K, I think. The last one was 888. It was 888 pounds. But this one, I'm almost certain this one's bigger. 
I don't know. I don't know if it was good for the world that they broke away from Europe. I don't know if it was good for the world that they broke away from Europe. London, Brexit. Oh yeah. Well, it's not happened yet, right? You want to raise? I was thinking about it. Yeah. Check. Ace Jack for Helmy Jack. Ten for Taka. Take a stab on the flop. Helmy going Check. nowhere. Eight of clubs on the turn. Good card for Helmuth. Picks up the nut flush draw to go along with his ace high. Check, check. Check. Offsuit five on the river. Ace check. I was calling on the turn, clubbies. How about the river? All right, that's a good, Audrey, probably. Audrey. That's a read thing, you know, like. You picked up, I was ready to raise there. Well spotted. <laughs> I wouldn't have fooled you if it came ace high. <laughs> You'd have been like, he was singing a raise and he has it. Helmy looks down at queen, 10 of clubs. See your Broadway hand. Sorry, it's just call. Tonka looks down at my favorite hand in Texas Hold'em, pocket aces. Got a raise from Tonka and a quick call from Helmuth. Maybe Tonka can get some movement in the right direction here. Oh, and it's a bad flop for Helmuth. Flops middle pair in a gutter, but he's got a lot of equity against Tonka's aces. The Tonk fam here is gonna have to get a hold. If Tonka can't get a hold here, his chance of winning 17. this match will go down drastically. Quick call from Helmuth. We're seeing a turn. Oh, brutal turn for Tonka. Phil improves to two pair against Parker's aces. Check, check, though. Nine on the river. The board is a chop. Now, if Tonka decides he thinks Helmuth does not have a king, he could make a move. A move that could very well get through. 3,000. But I'm not sure it can get through for this price. Pretty cheap bet, just half pot. Here we go, Phil, here we go. Wow, it's a bad, bad run up for me. And he gets the fold. I just thought you were drawing dead on the turn, so I checked it quickly. What do you have? At least two pair. At least two pair. Yeah. Phil's certainly telling the truth. Yeah, it was going to be a big pot if. Uh, Let's go, Tonka. I mean, obviously, I'm snap calling all your river bets. Unless the board, unless I fill up, then I'm all in. Ah. Damn it. You hit the two pair on the turn. Well, you've got to share equal information if you want to hear all that. That board sucked for my hand. I had a really fucking good hand. Kings? Kings is a straight. Yeah. It's an oh, upper level poker strategy around. going on here, guys. God, I had you drawing dead. Oh, that sucks for me. Oh. <laughs> all I have to do is bet the turn, but I got a little, like... 
Looked like you had your, looked like you wanted to keep bluffing, you know? Creative take on the word dead. Check. Race 12. Tonka's got the top pair. Does make the call. Interesting decision here Probably on the Probably going to check the river. Let's just see. Check. Four in the river makes a five a straight. Now, does Tonka think his top pair is good? If he does, he might go over some value. It is kind of a weird spot. A fold, right? gets, yeah, and gets a Good fold. Don't look now, but now it's just a three to one advantage. All right, you cried about my hand that, that time. Huh? I told you I had at least two pair. What did you have? If you, what, if, did you hit the two pair on the turn or the flop? Uh, I had queen ten of clubs. It came jack ten eight. I had aces. Yeah. I believe it. Man, if I bet the turn, the match could be over. The match would no. be over? No, I guess not. <laughs> how how would the match be over? <laughs> God, I had a bad feeling about that flop. Oh, it's a good thing I didn't move in on the flop. Open from, or sorry, call from yeah, Helmy. Yeah, ton of clubs. Uh, and yeah. a raise from Tonka with 98 diamonds. It's a strong holding. It's a really good turn card. It was great turn card. I guess a nine is better. Not really. Not worth my hand, at least. Yeah, I agree. Bit of an action flop here. Flush drop for Tonka. Pair of tens for Helmy. Unrelated note, definitely some of the effects of that beer right now. 3,000? Randall B for 4-8 limit. Randall B, 4-8 limit. We got a raise in the flop by Helmuth. It's a bit of a weird raise. Five on the turn now. What will Phil do? Checks it back. And our friend Tonka is gonna have to fire. He's gonna have to fire here. This is clearly the worst hand he can have in his range. There's simply no way around it. He's gonna have to put Phil in a spot. I think I have the nuts, but I'll check. You got it. Oh, disagree I don't think you with our line though. here, friends. I'm not folding. <laughs> I just, but unless you move in. But then I might have to find the call button to try to end it. I had a flush draw. God, the queen 10. Oh man, what a weird hand that was. <clears throat> Yeah, cool board. It was a cool board, yeah, yeah. super cool board for aces. I love it. <laughs> it was okay. a cool board for the hand. It's just awesome. <laughs> I mean, if I move it on the flop, you're going to snap it, and then I hit a queen, it looks like it's over. <laughs> Only the tie. And then I get the miracle. 
Hey, hunt. Sam M for one three. Check. Matt U for one three. How much? Tonka goes ahead and bets the flop. Second pair. A little Check. backdoor flush draw action. Bill does have two overs. Plenty of equity. And he picks up an open ender. Interesting spot now. Check, Phil. Check. Tonka. Check. Four bricks out. Phil checks once again. Tonga has to feel pretty good about his pair of threes. He's going to go for some value. Looks like he will. Is Phil buying it? Hard to say, he does have some chips out here. Three, and he makes the call. Man, good bet. I told myself there's no way he's betting a three here. Thanks. Good bet. There's no Shot way he's like betting Doug a three, the man. but he makes slow dude. playing every Much hand. Appreciated. Good bet. Thanks. Hey, he won the first match. The first match was won by Olivier Bousquet. Many more to two. come. Like I told Phil, we're just going to get to the round three. And I don't I, agree. And then, and then I don't mind. You know? I don't agree. I'm just not about getting swept. In fact, I'm definitely going to win it in three. I'm good. Thank you. Call. Yeah. Queen deuce for Taka. 7 5 for Philly Helmutes, as some might say. Got a bet for Phil. I'll take it down. Why aren't you playing Doug? I actually played the last King of the Hill. Can't get in all of them, guys. Sometimes you gotta send them out. I was happy to be the commentator as well. I mean, I do enjoy playing poker, but uh, it's okay to be on the booth One double up, Phil. Too. Now we're back to evens. Are you saying you have 25? Just about. 24? 26? What is it? 26, I think, something okay. like that. Twenty-six thousand, fifty-two bigs, something like that. All right, something like that. I can figure out on my end too, right? Queens for Helmuth. Lim Sim was going for the trap. Talk goes to the check here with the jack eight. Whew. Big flop for Tonka. Flops a straight. Seven. Now what is Tonka gonna do here? Three. Makes three K to go. Oh, for a little value. Tough spot now for Helmuth. 
Got the over pair, but tough to win with this hand. This was not the way I envisioned this hand going. You know what I mean? Like, I was envisioning putting it all in before the flop, but. You may have accidentally bluffed me there. Accidentally? So you folded a really good hand, is what you're saying? I had an overpair. An overpair? Yeah. With no heart? Yep. Damn it. I was very disappointed when I looked in the. I, I really was pretty sure I had the Queen of Hearts in there. It wasn't in there. Five four Shitaka raises. He gets a fold from Philly with the Aegis God. Now I'm calling him Philly Hong. It's Jesus. Jesus. It's contagious. You've been raising my limps a fair amount, so of course I limped in with nines and queens. You know. A nine hand was sad. I wanted to keep him. I wanted to keep him. You know, I actually don't hate that fold from, from Phil with the queens <clears throat> there. Terrible playability. Any other overpair is better. Doesn't have a heart. I don't hate it actually. It's kind of weird, but I, I don't. I don't hate it. Call. Phil calls the Jack-10. Tonga checks pocket fours. Ace, four, sorry. Didn't he just have pocket fours? Am I crazy? All right, six, five now, sorry. Open ender here for Tonka. Jack-10 for Helmuth. Bet and call on the flop. Yvonne, Yvonne for four, eight limits. Five on the turn. Proves to a pair of fives. We'll fill fire again. Small lead here from, from Tonka. That'll be enough to do it. Got to be a lot closer if I didn't give you that 12,000. Nines. I mean, I was worried about the ace jack. I was worried about like the ace jack of clubs, but I thought maybe you had sevens or an eight or a four. Eric, your table came from one of the and I don't think you're paying it off with ace queen high, but maybe. I mean, it's tough for me to have a lot of hands. Yeah. for diamonds for Tonka. Check. Queen three deuce. Top pair for Helmia. Check. Both players pick up gutters in the turn. spot now for Tonka who bets and faces a check raise. We see a lot of these check mate raises from Phil with Murray. some middling strength showdown hands. Murray, still interested in five, five. Generally speaking when you see this from players it means that their call ranges tend to be a bit weaker because hands that would normally call down are now being raised Murray, on the street. 
Wow. Hopefully they don't talk it though. Don't worry, I had it. I was I was rooting for you to do something crazy. I'm like, this could be it. He could re-raise here. And I'm just jamming. I love this comment. You guys remember when they changed hosts for the High Stakes Poker Show? Doug is like that Norman guy, or whatever his name mm. is. Too theoretical and boring, not much entertainment. Are you talking about Norman Chad? You think that that was the pairs. theoretical guy? That's what I need to do. I'm shocked. You beat my queens. I mean, by crook or by, <laughs> by legitimacy. <laughs> you did beat queens. <laughs> I'm actually shocked. Wild Bill. By hook or by crook. <laughs> We got 10-7 on the button for Helmuth. Matthew. Indeed, guys, classic one Chuck Doug. Okay. Matthew for five five. Believe this went limp check. Tiger with the pocket eights. Oh no, I'm sorry, it went raise call. Apologize. Bets the flop and does take it down. Doing a little bit of a little bit of the uh, play by play, a little bit of color every now and then. How much is it now? Twenty-seven-three or something. Yeah, it's good. Yeah. Just rough, right? I also, if you say twenty-seven, and that's. I also miss Gabe Kaplan, fam. I also miss Gabe Kaplan. All right, eight four offsuit and king eight offsuit, king queen seven, Tonka, top pair, the goods. How am you drawing it? A measly two percent equity, but he's taking a step. Tonka now with the top pair. Does make the call. Gonna be hard for Helmy to turn much equity, and he does not. Yeah. Tonka will win this hand unless. He like folds. Check, check, check. Eight on Station, the river. An action card. Bill Tonka. Bill Two pair Matthew. now. Helmuth now with his fourth pair. How is Tonka going to play it? Looks like he's reaching for chips. He's going to fire out a bet. Not even a, not even a hesitation there from Phil. Knows he's beat. Let's go. So far, I'm getting white magic, Phil. If you're folding over pairs. Yeah, no, I did. I had queens. I couldn't decide whether I wanted to have a heart with it or not. <laughs> Jack Deuce for Tonka. Check. King five deuce, deuce, both players improved to pairs. Helmuth with the better pair of fives and a backdoor queen eye flush draw. Ace on the turn doesn't change too much. Helmuth now with a kind of interesting bet. Three fourths pot with his third pair. Pull the pair to you again. God damn it. Just get in there, please. It's a good no, lay down. That man. was a lie, that one. <laughs> that one was definitely a lie. You owe me one if I tell you what I had. <laughs> yes or no? All right, I owe, you, I owe you one. I had a five with a queen. So if you had a five, you were dead. If you had a deuce, you were dead. <laughs> I had a deuce. No, you owe me one. Oh, I don't have to waste a hand reveal. Yeah, but one of like equal caliber. You don't get to ask for it in like a like a 15k pot or a 20k pot. That seems reasonable. You should have negotiated that. Advance, for but I'll let that one slide. <laughs> <laughs> well, it seems what's fair is fair. So, for those of you wondering when the final will be, it's going to be at six. 
6 o'clock tomorrow, Eastern Time, 3 o'clock What Pacific. do you have, 6, 7? Is that your one? No. <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> Don't try to bait me now. <laughs> You tried to bait me into taking my free hand. <laughs> oh, that's funny. I should have let out on the king five deuce. Lead. <laughs> you got to call with ducks. Mm. Check. Both players break the flop. Tonka with the king high in the lead, though. It's not bad, and I imagine take it down. 22. He does raise, and he, he springs to life. Phil, with a nice little move here, picks up some chips. Twenty-four. As you can see Just from our chip count good. display here on your screen, Helmut but I want to know. Yeah, it's 000. important to know on these spots, right? Far ahead, Tonka with 26. 25. 20, 26. Nice tray of clubs for Helmuth. Just slumps into the pot. And check from Tonka with the five deuce. A6-4, Tommy way out in the lead with his top pair and back on flush draw. But Tonka does have some equity. Now he's got a little bit more. Picks up a flush draw on the turn to go along with his gutter. But we're gonna see a bet here on the turn from the Tonk lad. He does decide to bet. 22. Phil with the raise, check back raise. Got some moves. Phil's, you know, you gotta, you gotta admit, he might not play kind of standard. Just call, Philly. But uh, this is too dangerous. Come on, to you didn't have it again. I oh did have it. Try to play tough. That's just what I gotta do, man. I gotta make some pairs. That's what I said. <laughs> you make a, you make a pair on every hand. Uh, top pair aces, top pair queens, <laughs> pair fives. When I got a pair of ducks. <laughs> Some of those were small pots, but yeah. Hey, small pots add up. Yeah. Especially when you're at a three to one disadvantage. Good point. Ace two suited for Check. Tonka. Raise into Helmut's big blind, who calls with the jack five. Brick board for everyone, queen nine tray. Check. Previous to pair of jacks and bets a string of chips, which has an $800 value. Jacks. Jacks are good. Bill picks up another. Tonka moving in the wrong direction. He was getting some steam going for a bit there. Not so much now.
In other news, Twitter is now recommending me tweets about King of the Hill because I like tweets about King of the Hill. But these are not tweets about poker. I always liked Hank. Bet here on the flop. And Helmy to this bottom pair takes it down. This is this is the time that I make a pair. It's coming. Sometimes you don't want to make. A, sometimes you don't want to make a pair. I always prefer making pairs. <laughs> True. Well, I mean, <laughs> I see what you're saying, but yeah, I'll still take that pair. King Queen still take up, that pair. Pretty solid pre-flop holding. Twenty-five. Filling out with kind of an interesting re-raise with King Jack. Small. That's the thing about King Jack, you want to keep the range wide by enticing hands into the pot. Got a call from Tonka. Queen high board. Check. Tonka getting some needed magic going here. Can he win some chips with his top pair? Will Phil fire? Answer is no. We got ourselves a check check going. Now, Helmuth might sense some weakness, but Tonka's hand's pretty under repped. 5,000. And Tonka is now in the absolute perfect position to capitalize on his king queen. He trapped the flop. He kept Phil in. He hoped, he dreamed for a turn bet. And that effort is coming to fruition here as his top pair is good. Helmuth Stone dead. We're about to see a call here. He does make the call. At this point, I have to wonder, what does Phil put Tonka on? Jack on the river. Now, this is going to get pretty interesting. Phil has improved to a fairly strong hand. 6,200. <sighs> Wait. Ace of hearts, five no. of spades? I have king, queen, Phil. Oh. And Phil king now knows he's bluffing. Aces? You just have aces? Just have ace, queen? Don't overthink this, Tonka. Just have ace, king? You trapped him on the flop. Does have any ace of the heart? Oh, God. Don't overthink it. Boom! Of course you have to. Tonka! Yeah. King Queen's good. Yeah. Going hard in the paint. I got a bad card on the river. Jack. Tonka up to 35,000. Where are those Tonk Muppets at? Where are the Tonk Muppets at in the chat? Can he make a comeback happen? That's right, God, two claps it. in the background. That's right. Good hand. Thanks. Tonk hype. Oh, god damn. I finally re raised you after you raised every button and you somehow had King Jack beat. It's crazy. Mm. A very fortunate holding to have when you have that hand. Well, I've got a reason I've only re raised you twice in, in like 100 hands. That's not true. You've re raised me actually a decent chunk. Mm, maybe four times in all the matches. More, more, more. At least five or six. Hmm. I think. Unless I'm very, very wrong. Steamed up. Nice and steamy. Now help me through the king queen. So it's to raise it up, get a little call from Tonka.
2000? Big flop for Tonka. Top two, getting some movement. The tides are turning. Now, does he slow play or does he go for a little value? 6,000. Wow. We got ourselves a match on our hands. Wow, I always wait till I have it. How am I losing these pots? He plays every hand. Such a huge edge for me. That's it. Get steamed up. I'm steamed because, of course, I had it again. <laughs> Fuck. Only Phil he Helmuth had it that can, be, well. can he be up around, up in Full chips, and then be steamed about how hot his opponent is running. Chris Bob. <laughs> That's not how it works. That's not how it works. Holding a button? Why, don't do that. I got. I, I've dealt a lot of raising hands so far. That was the first one that didn't. I make need you to that. raise every button. It's just so much better for me. God damn it! Oh, I finally re-raised him with King Jack after he raised 62 buttons in a row when he had me beat. For the record, 62 is actually an accurate count of the amount of buttons. You know how they say chess players see 10 moves out ahead, 20 moves out ahead? Phil Helmuth is 62 moves behind. King Jack for Helmuth, he's in the lead here against Tonga's King 8. I'm not even looking. Rick Board. That'll get it done. That will get it done. How's everyone in the chat doing, by the way? Thank you for tuning in today what did I use to our second for it? Is it for it? King of the Hill. No. Yeah, I was kind of bummed out. I bet 6200, you're like, oh shit, he, I have king, queen, and I was like, oh god damn it. I'm just doing like the fucking live pro thing, you know, where you know you're never folding, but you're sad to call. Oh, I don't blame you. I mean, no, no, you're no. 6600 off of like, or 6200 off of like 10k. No, you were, you, you did everything right. I was just saying, you didn't do anything wrong. I was just saying, damn it, I thought I was going to win that. The jack looked like a great card, you know. When it popped off, I'm it like, did. yes, I win. Check. I appreciate everyone asking how I'm doing. I'm fine. I'm fine. I was born to do this. I was born to be behind a computer needling Phil Humuth. I used to play high stakes poker, but that was a past life. Now... I make YouTube videos. All right, we're rallying now, Phil. I also post on social media. You can find me there, Doug Polk Poker. Talk on the up and up. But I, I do appreciate, guys, in the chat, the support. A lot of support here for <laughs> one Chuck Doug, your host for King of the Hill 2. By the way, guys, Steam tomorrow will one be more, our And then you'll be fully steamed. It might have been, wor grand it final. been worse if the jack didn't come. I might have just moved you in that hand, right? Thinking you had like ace five offsuit or something, you know? Also, as a reminder, whoever wins this King of the Hill will be invited back to defend the belt for King of the Hill three coming up October 25th and 26th from Sugar House in Philadelphia. I'll be there again as your host. Seven. You might say, Doug, why are you hosting these things? And that is a great question. But I've been told at some point I might be able to get back in there, and I'm trying to be here for that moment. Tonka is 
He's in this, guys. He's in this. 38K. One big pot away from even. He opens it up with a 6-5. Helmuth with the ace jack. Thinking of re-raising here. Give me a second. I love how candid he is about his hand strength. But he does make the call. Let's see what we got cooking on the flop. Here. Ace, king, five. A little bit for both players. Tonga picks up bottom pair, but Helmuth is still in the lead with his top pair second kicker. How much? Tonga does decide to bet. We get a call here from Helmuth. Looking pretty good with his top pair. Jack on the turn gives Helmuth a gutter. No help to Tonka. Might slow him down a bit now. Three thousand. Bill goes for a little value and gets a fold. Lays it down. Damn it. I can't say damn it after every hand. I had it. That's how do you have it every hand? I don't have it every hand, but I'm okay, thanks. I told you I was thinking a re-raise and I had a big hand there. I'm okay. I need you to have ace 10. It would have been a big pot. Oh, God. Can't wait to watch it after and you just never had it. You know I have it, but you have to call, right? Like, what? Right now? Yeah, of course. Why do I have to call? Check. It's the way you play. You have you have to play every hand, right? Open ender here for Tonka. Gutter ball for Helmuth. The man staring me down while drinking a Miller Lite. It is crazy. If I could only realize, relay really the amount crazy. of women around right now. Oh, wait, I can. It's zero. Is that That's ace-king right, again? That's right. Yeah, yeah. Where, where's Shannon? Yo, Shannon, she it's said actually uh, meet her in the parking lot in like two minutes. Head over to the parking lot. Come two on minutes. now. You won the first match. You've got a chip lead in the second one. You've made top pair on 75% of hands, and somehow <laughs> it's crazy. Oh, there's Shannon. Uh, no, it's not 75%. Not even close. How did that, that just happen? Um, it's randomness. It just so happens every time I've raised the button, I've Let me get some of those waters. I haven't won any of them. Can I get two of them? Can I get five back on this? Thank you. Well, you won the biggest pot we played. That was I re-raised the button. Five back? No, you raise the button, and I three bet, and you four bet. Shove. Oh, with the ace king. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Agreed. How did that just happen? 5,000. All right, so I'm going to go ahead and qualify this from Phil as a move. I'm going to put this solidly into the move category. Sometimes you got the skills, and sometimes you got the moves. And this is, this is this is definitely a move. He senses weakness. Now, a bit of a tough spot for Tonka. A little suited queen ball on the button. He does make the call. We're taking a flop, guys. We got two not very good hands, and we are taking a flop. Let's see what we got. 10 4 deuce. How many deuce into the lead with a pair of fours? No luck for Tonka. Well, it does check. The moves look like they might beat this button call. 6,000. Turn deuce. Big bet from Phil. And he's going to take it down. <laughs> oh, you, 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 you correctly, uh, you were right. I was weak before the flop. 
But then I did have flop you. Damn it, I wish you went to bed a button yet. Left. <sighs> God, I called you really weak as well. I give but you credit. I just never connect. Well, and you do. See what I mean again, pairs? This is what I'm talking about, Phil. And you're complaining to me. <laughs> Unbelievable. No, all I said I'm is. fucking believable. Uh, You've been practicing your uh, your Phil Hemmuth whining game. <laughs> <laughs> so on right, stream, guys, so I've, been, I've been running pretty bad lately, just in terms of I have online. to do yeah. human and, you function. Know, sometimes I whine and go on. So and I'm, like, I'm going I to ha like hand you off in the very capable hands of two okay. people that, frankly, could not be less alike: Olivier Bousquet and the man. So I'll be back shortly. Might even eat some food because I, I forgot I haven't done that yet in a while. Um, but here we go, Olivier Bousquet and the man's. I will be back in a little bit. Sup, dude, it's your worst nightmare. Don't worry, dude, I'll be quiet. We'll let Tonka's and uh, Philly Helmies talk. <laughs> you guys don't think I'm capable of being quiet for four seconds? What's up, Olivier? What's up, bro? What, guys, the chat doesn't believe me. I'm gonna be super good, trust me. Call. You got it, queen high. Sevens. Looks like Phil picked off a bluff right there. Dude, this is what I was born to do, break down hands in real time. <laughs> oh, yeah? Yeah, dude. All right. Man, how do you keep up with this chat? This guy's it's crazy. impossible, dude. Just people showering us with that praise That was one of two bad <laughs> Is that what that it is? Is that what it is? The promise I will make to you, I could have worked. I checked the flop behind you and just called. I mean, yeah, but you've been calling me down with King High and stuff, so. True. That's true. Maybe it's maybe it's just terrible, you know? Likely. The promise, the promise I will make to you is I will shut the hell up any time our two heroes are playing. Okay? You don't have to mute it, Check. all right? The man's is going to be on his best behavior. Tonka electing to bet his second pair here. A couple back doors. Still out of the way with no equity. You know what I should do? I should just should not say a word until you guys are just bored by the silence and you're begging for me to say something. You know you want it. Yeah, please continue using hashtag one chug on point. Twitter. What is it? One I'm chug pretty good at keeping the man. Sizes down. Yeah, that seems easy to remember. Kind of rolls off the top. Yeah. <laughs> it does, yeah, I haven't been doing smooth. much to try to make him big either. True. <sighs> Guys, I'll tell you the truth. Doug is hunting down Shannon. He had eyes for her. I said he. I said I didn't want to be a home wrecker. Helmy flipped in with ace eight, Tonka with nine six, and Tonka checked nine? with ace eight. I like this check by Tonka. It's a hand that plays a bit awkward when you raise and get called, and an ace doesn't flop. And it's a bit disguised in them pots. All right, now I am good straight plus to the six. Congratulations, we do have more total fines. 500 all high hands. Starting down. Phil does this all the time. He like tries to get value 17? in these spots that are so thin. Like third pair here seems like such a natural check once you've gotten called on the flop. You know, like what what is he gonna call the flop with that calls a turn bet that you beat with a nine? But Phil does this a lot. Can I introduce you to some white magic, <laughs> Olivier's? Yeah, I guess. I mean, I, but I don't. You know, I think Phil. My guess is that Phil just checks here. I don't think he's going to turn his hand to a bluff, but he might. I can't beat a queen. I got it. Yeah. 
bit, bit of a strange bet, I think, on the turn. Nice hand. Thanks. Yo, chat, tell me how many reveal buttons have been used so far this match. That's what I'm here for, the reveal buttons. Getting a variety Unfortunately, of Unfortunately, I did have something. 41 seems high. <laughs> that is unfortunate. <laughs> that time it was unfortunate. Because <laughs> you had a, or a nice... queen. You probably go three with a queen as well. <laughs> you just got the chat to just... I would have value about any queen with a kicker there. The people who type 69 and 420, that is correct. <laughs> Check. I just want to let the chat know that um, we've actually gotten rid of the small blind and big blind. We're just going to play 500 big blinds deep, deep 4, into the night. Hamlet's just like rogely raising <laughs> the king eight offsuit, no spade. It's like check rates. And Tonka, he bluffed at that time. Nine five. Plus draw. I mean, plus draw. No spade, but uh. do the gutter. Olivia, can you, you have a tell when that time. you still owe me one? So I still owe you. <laughs> Go ahead. When you Phil puts his hands like up against his mouth, kind of like that, you know that, that move where For he does a pot this? Like that. I do, yeah. Yes, yeah, slightly tell? bigger. Anything. Slightly bigger. Slightly bigger. I agree. I, I doubt Phil's giving much away with that move. He's probably doing it when he has good hands and bad hands, and it's hard to like tell the difference. But. Uh, yes, Schust in the chats. I will adopt you. Maybe you could like do an analysis of Phil and like all the times that he does that move and see if he's bluffing or not. I will, dude. I definitely have the time to kind of break that down. <laughs> yeah, you do. Yeah. I feel limited again. Not taking a stab here on this board. Tonka was just like nothing here. The nine you saw. He does have the deuce of spades. And Phil waiting, waiting to get two checks before taking a stab with this hand. Not, not a totally unreasonable strategy. Yo, chat, uh, let me know. Has has Philly Helmuth had a classic Philly temper tantrum so far? Has he had a blow up? This is like a, a weird thing where I'm technically commentating, but I'm asking you guys for information. It's kind of it's kind of cool how that works. Someone you just know what you have? Nipples in the 27, chat? 28? 30, I think. 30. Maybe, maybe 29. 28, 29, 30, something like that. Okay. New right hand quad jack with a 7. Check. Wow, big flop here for Tonka and Helmuth. With the top pair, this could get interesting. Walk it up. Decent sized bet here, too. 2200. Say 11 outs is a lot of outs or a hell of a lot of outs? I'd say a hell of a lot. Yeah, hell I, of a lot. I agree. Bit, bit, bit unlucky that they share the 10. Tonka had Jack 3 of hearts or 9 3 of hearts. That would be more. If you guys are going to type outs in the chat, will you please at least use a Z and show some respect? It's really an unusual like amount of time that Phil is taking for like just one bet. Ben, four eight limit, Ben. Here 
Wow, this is this is not. <laughs> Just like bet the flop, that's all. Wow. Oh. Wow. Oh snap. This could get fun. Well, this is a terrible card for Tonka. I mean, you know, n now he could be up against the full house. Uh, even if a three comes, if Phil has an eight, he's lost. So, like, this could easily go check, check. I mean, Phil could lead. And, I mean, 8,800. Wow. Over bets the pot here. This is just so annoying if you're Tonka. Like, you flop huge. And sure, this card came in, it's bad, but, like, you don't expect to get a larger than a pot sized bet, like, thrown at you out of position here. And you're just, like, so frustrated. <laughs> you can kind of see it in his face, too. Would you say it's kind of similar to having twos on the button, having some Jamoke <laughs> shove all in on you? <laughs> <laughs> Some jamoke, yeah. I mean, if he does hit a heart, though, and uh, if he calls and he hits a heart, Phil's going to lose it. Why don't you use that big brain of yours to tell us how what kind of pot odds he's getting on this call right here? I mean, what, I mean, if he, you know, if he bets the pot, he's uh, he's got a. Oh wow! Oh, that's amazing. I'm all in. Oh, cut! I call. Wow. Three eights. Sick. Oh, come on. Uh oh, oh here it comes. It. Everyone, the stand by for oh, tantrum. With the stand by. Three. It's my lifelong dream right here, boys. Mount St. Phil is about to erupt, folks. <laughs> <laughs> to play <laughs> Phil Helmuth heads up and get him fucking steamed up, walking yeah. around, talking to himself. This is it right here. The, go the goddamn dream. I hope Phil has his Fitbit to count all these steps. Are you fucking kidding me? That's why I'm oh Phil Helmuth. God. That's why I'm Phil Helmuth. What's that? Because you have like five outs for all the money and call over pot bet. But I did it to you. It's not even your fault. You white magic me and I got lucky. What can I say? I think it's he has definitely 20. more than that. Eighteen four seventy five. Yeah, Eighteen four seventy five. Looks like more than that. Uh, it's, Two, this four, is sixteen. 16 10, 12, 14, 16, 17, 17, 18, 18 yeah. I mean, We could be here for a while. We could be here. That was that was white magic. He went to saw the proverbial lady in half, <laughs> but it was a real lady, and he just cut her in half. That's what happened. Oh man. Jesus Christ. No worries. Jeff Gross Poker, yes, this is the second match. That was a really good impression of a typical chat person, though. <laughs> wow, what a bad beat for all the cheddar. Whew. Are you calling it off with a three, I guess, right? You got to. You can't Jeff just Gross call Poker. Uh, uh, Philly held you won the first one. What are the blinds? Jeff Maybe Gross, I am. I am here to answer all I your logistical questions. 500, what a fucking beat. That's why I'm Phil Helmuth. They don't even know it. I'm like, wow. <laughs> what the fuck kind of beat is that? How much you got now? 10, 20, 30, like 40 still? Yeah. That's a good question. Hold on, I'd like to know myself. As you say, I'd like to know myself. 
38. Well, if you watch the last King of the Hill match, though, we all know Philly Helmuth can battle back with a very, very short stack. No, that's true. He's not even really short. I mean, he's, he's down 64. It's not even a huge lead. Maybe he'd even feel more comfortable if he punted off another 20K, get really short, <laughs> and then he's really in his element. Yeah, I mean, the thing is, you know, it's always tough psychologically when you're up a lot. Oh. Phil was, did have a large lead wow. after the, the, the <laughs> nines to sixes hand. Um, wow, I almost shoved on the flop. Tonka battled back and then doubled, so... That, that's a bit frustrating. Wouldn't have, couldn't have folded then. I know. Can fold the turn. Huh? I can fold the turn. Of well, you course. Just, you just don't know I have an eight. Like, I thought there was a chance, of course. I'm pretty sure you're paying off the river with a three. I, I know you watched the video against Jungle Man where I moved on in the river quickly. Race 2000. And, with and the, he with folded the queen trips. Jack? Yeah. yeah. So I was doing the same thing. I was just, I knew in your mind you were gonna, and you had a three, I think you're gonna pay it off. So beautiful the way I play Hold'em. God damn. What a beat. Oof. Check. This is tough to listen to. It's gotta be tough to just like fade this while you're playing him. If he does this tomorrow, like if he wins and does this tomorrow. Check. I'm just gonna have to like, I don't know. This is actually like a good trial run for you because you get it in your ear balls right now. <laughs> you're building up Phil stamina. <laughs> Phil just has trips here. No problem. Jack Deuce. 47. Snake Man 3342. I've been saying that for like 18 months. <laughs> I've made that comparison. It's, it's bananas. It's a crazy comparison. <coughs> There's some ways in which they're similar. Some ways, obviously, they're Ugly different. Beat. Wow. All right, I'm going to throw out a theory. Wow. Is there any I, chance? I wasn't sure if you were even drawing live. Because, like, uh, the way I played it, you have to go with an overpair. So I, I really didn't want a heart or a spade, but. I didn't think you'd call $9,000 with a heart draw. I did get straight quads. Maybe pay the price. That was a dope hand, especially when he let into me. Yo, chat, I do this thing when other people start talking, I stop talking <laughs> to appease you, OK? <laughs> it's called being a good commentator, something I have a lot. All right, but you want the theory. Let me tell you the theory. Is there any chance that Tonka's is Phil Helmuth's son? Just think about it. <laughs> Just think about it. Go to the Wikipedias. Look at the ages. Could Philly Helmuth have sired Tonkas 25 years ago? Just ask me. It would have been more exciting if it was all on the flop, right? <laughs> he would have theory. basically had a heart draw. You had 10-8 as well, right? Yeah. Bad hand for me to be up against. Yeah. I mean, you're talking to a guy that made Olivier <laughs> do a piss <laughs> test. I'll make I'll make Phil do a paternity test. Don't even <laughs> don't even test me. Check. Uh, this has some potential here. This this board. Four. Wow, Phil just leads for the pot here into trips with an open ender. And if a six comes, oh my god. <laughs> six would just be crazy. Ugh. Now this is where it gets interesting. Does Phil try to go for this pot? In, in my experience, in these Check. types of spots, Phil still's given up and he gives up again. Thanks, Craig. Appreciate that. <laughs> Dude, can we talk about my self-confidence, Craig? Because I think I put both of theirs to shame, bro. Come at me. <laughs> 
one chug thug somewhere deep into the casino drinking exactly one beer in a very quick manner. Shout out to Uncle Alcoholic. <laughs> Great love, man. Did he get the spelling right? No, but I mean, it was a valiant effort. I mean, I appreciate, appreciate the idea. Uh, what, what do you think? Oh my God, Phil, what's happening? Like, what, what's happening right now, Phil? This is a, this is a, this is a bluff. Like, it's he's not actually gonna bluff. He's bluffing that he's gonna bluff. Are you saying Ten High isn't good here? No, what I'm saying is that he's pretending to do this. He's not actually gonna do it. No I chance he does it. Oh. That is Good the fold. reveal button, folks. You guys came for Philly Helmuth. I came for the reveal button. This is my one. moment. One of the bots? Five one. Right. You gonna pay me for four? No, I had ten high. But okay. I was thinking about check raising you. Yeah, yeah. He, was really he was really thinking you about it. You called such a big race before with a, you called such a big bet before with a draw. I thought maybe you just did it again. Thank you for asking, Just Selly. My Twitter Take handle is at want. Pete Manzanelli. I mean, up to Phil. I'm good without. What's your uh, What's your play. Twitter feed like? What kind of stuff are you tweeting out? It's just like babes, beers, <laughs> oh, yeah. bros. Babes, beers, and bros. Just kind of the I three think, Bs, dude. Play, right? yeah, that's cool. And get some bousquets on there, yeah, too. Yeah, all right, yeah. The four Bs. Or something, whatever. Yeah, up to you, man. I don't care. Look Phil, at these. Phil with the real cash ace queen. Phil, Phil's 35-minute grilled cheese sandwich break wasn't enough. He wants a five-minute, <laughs> I assume, a <laughs> tomato soup break. <laughs> Hey, Squaw. Doug uh, took a short break. Doug has been doing this for hours. He's a machine, but he's not actually not a machine. So he uh, he took a short break. He will be back soon, and the high level of commentary will <laughs> resume at that point. <laughs> you guys just have to kind of make do with us for now. You guys are... You guys are getting to enjoy the vocal stylings of two of the greatest No Limit Heads Up poker players of our generation. So why don't you guys just sit back, pop another Funyun in your mouth, and enjoy your evening in your Spider-Man spider pajamas. 45. Tough to fold once you river a queen. What would you do here with Queen Four, man? Queen Four, dude, is uh, just kind of an auto shove for me. <laughs> auto um, shove. I got another big one, Phil. Aggressive. I mean, you do block pocket queens, ace queen, and uh, and 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 the wheel. So I mean, it seems like a reasonable shove here. That's right. I mean, I, that's kind of uh, what went into my thought process was I have the queen blockers. <laughs> yeah. It's an obvious shove. <laughs> right. Yeah. Yeah. I like to balance my range. That's good. Sounds like a pretty sound strategy. Get some discipline, Tonka. Let it go. You bet more than the pot. Come on, buddy. Oh. I feel getting paid off. I was the number one candidate. 
How can I be the number one candidate when you have a queen? Oh, I don't know, but that uh, that candidate aye, aye, aye. got elected That's to office. That's a bad river. <laughs> Unfamiliar with a high-level troll from my Twitter. I missed it. Appreciate it. Appreciate the troll. Uh, chat, let us know, is Mans and Olivier the greatest commentator doer of all time? One for yes, two also for yes. Let us know. <laughs> Uh, I mean, it's kind of unfair because you're probably a part of the greatest commentary team with wh whoever your partner is. So I'm just like. Also, three is yes, too. So <laughs> you guys just got pwned, dude. <laughs> you guys know what pwned means, right? This feels like an audience that knows what pwned means. Check. Wow, look at this. Phil checked back 10 9 of diamonds. Um, or no. Tonka checked back sixes. Uh, and then. Spike to set on the turn. Phil with a pair, a gut eight shot, thousand. and a full straw. Wow. Phil check raise this. Uh, he's going to get three bet here. This is a small raise. Tonka's not going to give him credit for like randomly eight, nine. I think Tonka's going to raise here. Helmet's going to have to at least call. And we're going to play a big pot. I'm just going to kind of. Oh, he just called. Oh, oh, come on, buddy. Come on, buddy. Now he's going to check. check. Yeah, obviously. And you got to stick it to Phil there. You want some iced tea? Some iced tea, dude? <laughs> uh, you're trying to pawn off your piss <laughs> to me? <laughs> this is like very reminiscent of that 10-3 hand they had where you had the set, then you had the flush draw. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I mean, there's some similarities. Not, not that many. Will you please just say it's the exact <laughs> same scenario <laughs> <Yeah>. unfolding <laughs> again? Yeah, yeah. No, good call. Good call. <laughs> Pretty bad card for Phil. I mean, the king of spades. Like, there aren't too many worse cards I can think of. I mean, obviously, he was already beat, but... Yeah. There haven't been a lot of opportunities, but I, I, I don't remember Tonka making too many big river bluffs. I think he's made a couple river bluffs in some like smaller, medium-sized pots, but you know it's hard because in this format you don't see that many big pots, you don't get that many opportunities, but I, I don't remember Tonka really going for it in too many huge pots. That might actually make sense against Phil, because Phil has made some pretty light call downs, but there's always that back and forth. Shout out to Ryan Meese in the house. But Ryan Meese, dude, wink twice if you're the real Ryan Meese. We don't know if we're getting catfish, bro. Wow. He gets called. Wow. Let's all call him Call Station Philly Helmuse. He Hashtag Call Station Philly Helmuse. Lucky River for you. That was Lucky River for me. <coughs> Well, you had a one-outer on the turn. A one-outer? One. You got two pair with the six. That's what I'm saying, good river. You don't bet it. One fucking out. Jesus Christ, what the fuck is going on here? You got him drawing dead half the fucking hands. He's just dead, 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 dead. Raises every fucking button. Gets all these weird, bad spots like all the rest of them against. Did we just lose our audio there? I promise you guys I'm not talking over Philly Helmies. We have a Mount St. Phil 
situation and we just went mute. Maybe Phil is has on such a tirade right now that the language is so foul that Poker Night in America has had to cut it from the stream. <laughs> They're but taking a break. Wow. They're taking a break. Phil just like decided on his own to take a break. That's that's Does that's anyone white magic right there? That's why magic. Yeah. Does anyone take a does anyone work around here? We got Doug Polk's on break. We got Philly Helmuth on Looks break. Looks like it's just me and you, buddy. It's just you and me holding it down in the chat who just loves us so much. Almost as much as we love the chat. We love them so much. Wow. How does it why doesn't it go a bit slower? Yeah, guys, we can you guys all you maybe confer amongst yourselves and you know, maybe nominate one person <laughs> to to say something? Could the chat should elect like a group of representatives. Exactly. This is anarchy right now, and we'd like to see something more like a democracy, please. So yeah, what just happened here was an impromptu uh, break. Philly Helmuth did need his tomato soup break. <laughs> Philly Helmuth cannot complete a match without getting um, read a bedtime story <laughs> in his tomato soup, and he will not continue unless there are also crackers to dip in that tomato soup. So you guys are just stuck with us now. Doug Polks has vanished. He's, he's practicing his chugging techniques somewhere. I got to piss like a racehorse. But I'm going to keep downing Miller Lights every five minutes. <laughs> dude, Olivier, how many Miller Lights have you seen me down? I don't know, like 17. That's right, dude. I'll tell you one thing right now, though, Chad. If one of you even thinks of dropping off this stream, I swear to God, I will hunt you down and I will slap you silly. You're going to stay right here. You're going to listen to me talk and you're going to fucking love it, all right? 